So you have a bunch of abandoned carts, right? Kind of sucks. But how do you actually turn those abandoned carts into paying customers and in turn some money? That's what we're going over in this video. Yo, what's up guys? Nash here coming at you with a brand new video. And today we're talking about how you can actually convert those uh, abandoned carts that you get into paying customers and, and some money for your Shopify store. And uh, honestly, it's, it's one of the better sources of revenue if you can win back those customers at abandoned cart because they showed interest. Obviously, they're interested in the product or else they wouldn't have added it to the cart. But for whatever reason, they just abandoned and they didn't check out. So if we can get them back, then we have a better chance of actually being able to make a sale. So today I'm going over three apps that I use uh, to actually you know, win back those customers. And uh, yeah, let's dive into it. So the first one that I want to talk about is called Klaviyo. And it's an email marketing system similar to like Aweber or MailChimp or all these other different GetResponse, all these other different ones. Um, but the reason I like this one so much is because it integrates with Shopify really well. So uh, let me show you kind of what I'm talking about. Basically, uh, I'm just on like a test account here. But um, it has these things called flows and also campaigns. So a campaign is like what you typically would set up in like Aweber or whatever. But a flow are these preset, um, basically campaigns that integrate with Shopify uh, really well. So you can do what's called an abandoned cart series. So that's as soon as somebody abandons the cart, they are actually sent an email and um, you, know, you can do as many or as little as you want and you can set the time intervals. So let me just click into this uh, so you can kind of see but uh, but yeah, as you can see, uh, you know, abandoned cart one, abandoned cart two, abandoned cart three. We can actually change the times here. So if you want to schedule this two hours after the checkout started, or like twelve hours, or you know, whatever you want to do it, um, in you know, three three emails, you can add more emails, and uh, yeah, it's actually really great for you know doing abandoned carts. Um, but besides abandoned carts, you can actually do what's called the new customer thank you. And this is where you can do like discounts and try to try to upsell the new customers. Um, and also do email series in order to provide value and hopefully make more sales in the future. So these these uh, flows and series are actually really nice and that's why I like Klaviyo and it's, it's free so uh, I mean, you know, why not? So the second one that I like to use is called Facebook Messaging Remarketing. It's by, uh, it's by Cartback. And why this is super cool is because um, a lot of times people get used to email, they get used to getting marketing emails and stuff. But what this does is it actually sends your customer a Facebook message. Um, and I've found some really good results with this uh, and it converts pretty high and people open the messages a lot because you know it's a Facebook message as opposed to an email, which you know, I don't know, for some reason the conversion rate is just a lot higher. So what it does is basically it just adds this little, um, you know, whatever this is, little message here. And uh, you know the person opts in and they'll be automatically sent a series of follow-up emails, which I can show you right here, um, is basically what it looks like. So you can edit these and, you know, hey, just wanted to let you know your card's about to expire, we temporarily reserved it, and then you can have a photo of whatever the product is that, that they abandoned. Um, and you can set up up to three messages, I believe, and I don't think you can set the, uh, the intervals in terms of, uh, you know, when they're sent or whatever, but you can send discount codes, all kinds of different stuff, integrated with different um, you know, Facebook pages. And it's, it's actually really nice um, in terms of getting better conversions. So uh, I think it's Facebook Messenger Remarketing by Cartback. That one's a really good one that I like as well. And the last one, this one you don't necessarily need if you know how to do retargeting with Facebook. Um, but if you don't know how to do that and you want to have like an easy solution, uh, there's this thing called Retarget App, which is free. They just charge a commission based on every sale that you make. Um, and then obviously you have to pay for uh, Facebook ads and whatever. But uh, basically what Retarget App does is it's, it's just an app that you can download onto your, um, you know, onto your Shopify store. And it is super simple. You just, you know, put your ad message here, you know, connect to the Facebook page, and then it automatically chooses whatever product it was that your customer saw last. Um, you know, so if it's like this wireless cat toy, whatever it is, then it would automatically show them that ad. Now, it's not as targeted as, uh, say, maybe if you were to do it through actual Facebook, which I prefer. And if you guys want me to do videos about how to do, uh, you know, retargeting on Facebook, I can. Um, and, you know, just let me know in the comments if you want to see that. But, uh, but yeah, so this is just a super easy way to do some remarketing with Facebook. 
So hopefully these uh, three tips or three apps are helpful for you guys. Hopefully you can download them and start seeing some better conversions and being able to actually you know, convert those add to carts to actual sales because especially when you're doing free plus shipping, the add to carts kind of rack up and it, it would be nice to convert some into sales, right? So hopefully this was helpful for you guys. If it was, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and leave a like. Let me know that you like this content. You want me to continue making it on a daily basis. And uh, yeah, you know, it just helps me with motivation and being able to you know, make great content for you guys on a daily basis. Lastly, leave me a comment in the comments about you know, what you wanna learn. If there's something holding you back, if there's something you're confused on, whatever it is, let me know in the comments below and I'll be sure to make a video about that to, to kind of address it. But if you have some more personal questions, go ahead and hit me up on my DMs in, at Nash Hagen on Instagram. Uh, you know, you can message me anything that you want. Um, obviously, it's like, you know, somewhat related. But yeah, just message me if you have any questions and I'm always replying, always want to help you guys out. So go ahead and do that. And uh, oh, lastly, I'm giving away some free consulting calls. It's going to be a limited amount, maybe like two to five, not sure yet. But if you want to get involved in those and you want to get a free coaching call, go ahead and check out the link below. Um, it's in the description somewhere and you can actually schedule a coaching call with me and we can go over your website, all that kind of different stuff. So hopefully this is helpful and I will see you guys tomorrow. I need you in the morning.